Wednesday. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here and haven't subscribed, just a little reminder to hit that subscribe button so you can stay tuned and know about all the videos. Um, it's Wednesday. I don't know if I said that yet. Um, I went to sleep super late last night. I just wasn't tired. Like I just, I think I have so much on my mind being Christmas week and feeling like I have so much to do, so little time. I know it's like the common complaint for everyone right now, but um, it's all good. It was hard to get up and get to the gym this morning. It was leg day though and I did my group leg workout. So thankfully that helped me get here if I was training on my own. I very likely could have skipped it. And so, got that done. It's now 8 o'clock. I am on my way to work and I have to stop first and get gas because I'm almost out of gas. You know, I like am out of gas, so hopefully I make it to the gas station and head to work. Nothing too crazy planned today, just typical work day, which has been crazy busy. And um, my sister's coming over tonight to massage me which will be good because I've been having like up in my like right side, like in my scapula area. Um, and it's like coming up into my neck. I've had a lot of tension there. I think it's because I get these like knots on my lats that need to be like massaged out. I think all the epic training Mark and I did with traveling and uh, lack of stretching and rolling while I was there are catching up with me. Plus I go to work and I sit at a desk and I'm like, not hunched over, but like I'm right-handed. It's just, it's all, it's all tense up in there. So hopefully my sister can kind of work that out tonight. And then tomorrow I'm scheduled to do hot yoga with my friend Bella, who I haven't seen in a while. So that'll be like the perfect combo, get a little, you know, rub down tonight. Actually, it's not going to be relaxing at all. It'll hurt. But I get that worked out tonight and then do some hot yoga tomorrow. I think will be a good combination. So, anyways, that's the plan. Gotta get going to work and I will see you guys soon. I just need to know if anyone remembers this song. I was in junior high when this came out. It was pretty sexual. It's a pretty sexual song. Hey guys, it's almost 2 o'clock now and I'm about to take a lunch break. Um, can't remember if I mentioned this or not, but uh, Yami invited me to, or included me, whatever, to participate in the YouTubers Secret Santa this year. So I think they did it last year and this year there's like a bunch of us and she used the, I think it's elfster.com website to put in everyone's info and it just like generated who you were Secret Santa for. So it's just kind of like a fun way to do something fun for Christmas. So I got my gifts and I think I'm going to have to like overnight them now because I'm super late being gone um, in Ohio. I just didn't get to shop. So I've got my bag of gifts with me here in this lovely Lulu bag. And look how cute the wrapping paper is, the puppies, it's upside down. But um, yeah, so I got those gifts last night. It was a lot of fun. I think we set like a $30 limit which is really hard to stay within like for me because I I don't know it's hard to do $30 but you want to make it like fun and and stuff so anyways that'll be fun check for those because there's a bunch of us doing it and I think most of us are going to try to upload our videos opening what we got on the 23rd We'll be posting that video on the 23rd, I believe. Sorry, I had to think about that. So be on the lookout for that. I got my Secret Santa package yesterday. I'm not gonna say who it's from yet, but it's good. It's gonna be good. I can just, I just have good feels like all over this box. I put it under my Christmas tree and I'm so excited to open it and share it with you guys. So be on the lookout for that video. This should be fun, going to the post office. How many days out before Christmas are we? Today's the 21st, four days before Christmas. And I'm gonna try to get it there in a day. Let's see how much this costs me. Well, I'm all for Christmas. All the happy smiles and the This is what it looks like, kids, when I leave work. It's about, I'm leaving late, actually. It's like 5.45, and I'm heading to my car, heading home, and as soon as I get there, my sister should be there to 
and massage me, which I desperately need at this point. I was feeling okay this morning, but after sitting at a computer all day and typing and clicking, I definitely get knots in there, so this should be good. When your sister comes over to massage you, but you both about to have a drink first. She didn't know it, but it, we've had a day, folks. Oh. We've had a day. Look how cute my sister is. Look at that. Is that a headband? It is a headband. So Walmart cute. Gear. I went hard at Walmart. Turn around so um, I can send the video to mom. <laughs> That's my mom. <laughs> mom. It's just the hairdo. Little jabroni. Huh? I said slow your roll, jabroni. Fill it up. Fill it up. Fill it up? Fill it up. <laughs> Not all the way. Just don't, don't jet me any. Thank you, wine lady. You know what your outfit reminds me of? Mom? Um, <laughs> no. It reminds me of in the Santa Claus with Molly Shannon when he goes on a date with Molly Shannon. Oh. Remember that? No. When she sings. Why does he go to, on a date with Molly Shannon? She, when he needs to find a wife or else he's not going to be Santa Claus anymore. Wait, what are we talking about? The Santa Claus with Tim Allen? Oh, okay. <laughs> Best thing about being a Christmas. Is we marry him? We're getting turned up on a Wednesday. Yeah, it's my day off. Turn up. <laughs> Not mine, but that's all good. <laughs> so I don't know what this is. It's like 9 o'clock at night right now. And I just got done getting massaged. I feel drunk. But like drunk from the massage, not from the wine. It's my hair. Do you want to talk about like how, like what kind of shit you felt? <laughs> What do you mean? Like, what, 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 tell me, like, tell the people the situation I had going on in my back. It was like, like, tell it, break some science out. What, what kinds of things did you trigger back there? I didn't trigger anything. It was hard. It's all matted up, right? Yeah. What's wrong uh, with me? My lips are so gross. They, they look glossy now. It's just chronic muscle tightness. And then dehydration. Mm-hmm. Traveling, definitely. Traveling. Like working out and not stretching. Yeah. Looks like there's a spider on my head. <laughs> I look very little next to you right now. You always look very little next to me. That's why I'm <laughs> always like this. What up, twin? Yeah. Um, yeah, so I think it was just did like an hour and a half massage on me. I yeah. think. Mm, what time is it? I don't know. Oh, it's almost nine. Yeah. Probably like an hour. That's good. Yo. Definitely feels a lot better. Like my arm, I feel like. Yeah. Definitely relieved. Try not to have a nip slip right now. <laughs> that would be good for views. Yes. It would help my male viewership go up. And female. <laughs> I'd watch it more. <laughs> That's it. Thank yeah. you so much. Use these later. Yeah. Did I just show a nipple? What are these again? We're going to use these. They're like little eye gel things to help with like bagginess. Yeah, eye bags. Yeah, definitely. Darkness, definitely rock like those. That. You know what? Put them in the fridge. You know what's funny? Um, why is it that I always have eye bags like the day after a massage and I weigh more? It's water retention because the increase in circulation in your body, if you don't rehydrate enough, and drink your enough. body will hold it. Because like normally like... And Jason's found this too. We'll both weigh like three pounds the day after massage, and I'll have like major eye bags. Yeah, just because, you have to drink a shit ton after yeah, a massage. Yeah, that's why they're always like you need to. Drink. I don't really know about the whole toxin bullshit because your like, body detoxes all by its. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, all, all day long. Stuff, yeah, but you're yeah when you're increasing the circulation, you are pushing fluids right. out of your muscles. Right. So when you drink, you'll pee those out. Right. And well, if you don't drink, you're just gonna hold those. Hold out. it. Yeah. Right on. Yeah. yeah. I gotta drink some stuff right now. So I'm not so puffy tomorrow. Yeah. Right on. That was some science right there. Fucking science. Fucking science with a Walmart This won't neck. help though. <laughs> it's probably not gonna Just help me. Just some bags to you. It's helping right now. Yeah. That's all that matters. When your husband doesn't want you to have babies. <laughs> Did you see this? Come here. This is when you know it's it's a fish. Oh my god. Like, girl, get your birth control on. <laughs> like, don't forget it, or else I'll cut you. Well, guys, I think that's going to conclude today's vlog. Pretty much just a day in the life of a girl wrapped in a sheet. And, uh, 
<laughs> what? I'm wrapped in a sheet right now. I can see that. I'm trying to keep things tucked in. There's nothing wrong with that. You give me stink eye over there. I put you on blast for what you did. What'd I do? You left me a paper towel note on the floor. Yeah, so you remember to take your pillow? Oh, kids. You're a baby hater. I am. That man hates babies. I do. <laughs> All right, guys, that's going to be it. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. We'll see you tomorrow morning in the next one.